I wanted to welcome all of you to our week one in the agenda for today. You're going to start with two video lectures. One is done by me that goes by the name of Confusing Labels. It deals with the terms Latino, Hispanic, and Chicano, or Chicanx, and then Latinx. So I'm going to unpack all those labels. The second lecture is done by my colleague, Professor Jacobo, and deals with the colonization laws. And this is the one how Mexico invited Anglo-Americans to help colonize Texas, and then that ended up backfiring Mexico because we ended up losing Mexico. Not because of Texas, but because Americans were moving west, and that was an opportunity for them to grab the rest of Mexico. You also have two readings, one that goes by the title The Origins of the Anti-Mexican Sentiment by Raimundo Paredes, and the second one deals with the war, the U.S.-Mexican war, but how it happened here in San Diego at the local level. Believe it or not, one of the biggest battles took place at the San Pascual Valley, where we have the San Diego Zoo or the Wild Animal Park. I think they changed the name, but it is right in front of it. And if you wanted to go by, they have a museum. I'm not sure if it's going to be open because of COVID, but um, if they are open, you might want to go and check it out. You also have a film that deals with the U.S.-Mexican War. And this is a well-done documentary. It has historians from both countries. Mexico and the U.S., and they both contribute to be less biased as this nasty world continues, believe it or not, to have an impact, and I'm going to tell you where, at the U.S.-Mexican border that continues to be so controversial. You're also going to have your first quiz, and the quiz covers all the stuff that you have on your readings, you also have that on your film, and you also have that on your discussion. The discussion of this week, we're going to have two of them. One is where you're going to introduce yourself. You're going to let me know a little bit about yourself, why you're taking this class, what do you go by, what's your Mexican favorite holiday. In my case, it's El Dia de los Muertos. I love Pan de Muerto. I really don't like that much the mole. Some people do. That's okay. And the second discussion deals with the labels because I want you to know how to use this. So that is all for this week. Once again, enjoy this week and I'm looking forward to your discussions and reading and enjoying the class as much as you're going to enjoy. I hope. Take care.